It's, it's beautiful. beautiful. It's still snowing outside. Snow mountains and mountains of snow everywhere. It is cold. I've just been told that tonight it's actually very warm because it's only four degrees. Did you say four? Four. four. Yeah. Apparently four degrees is very warm. <laughs> yeah. But don't worry, I'm going to be taking some of this snow and packing it and bringing it home for my people in Cape Town. This is water wasted when we need water in Cape Town. For the last year, uh, winter is going to be short. Ah. Uh, yeah, because it started last year uh, very early. Last year it started early. From South Africa. Oh, this is a nice place. Yes. Mm -hmm. Have you been to South Africa? No, I saw my pictures. Oh, you must come. Yes, but I didn't have an uh, invitation from nobody. I'm inviting you. Yes. You come visit me. Thank you. <laughs> wow. You will love it. Yes, I would like to. But uh, how is the life there? Uh, the people speak English, yes? Uh, yes, almost everyone speaks English and... Okay. French a little bit? No. no. Very few speak French, but no, it's not a South African language. That's okay. Uh, yeah, but with English you get, a, you get along. We speak a lot of other languages, but not, uh, not French. That's nice, because I would like to marry one uh, beautiful uh, woman. What age? What age of a woman do you want? Wherever. It doesn't matter. I'll bring you a 90 year old woman. No! <laughs> no. But you said it doesn't matter. Tell me the age. I have so many women who are looking for a man. Ah. Mm -hmm. What? She feel me? Eh? She feel me? Yeah, I'm gonna show it to a woman who's looking for a man. Oh, it's me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> are you serious? I have a lot of friends who are looking for a man. Every time I come here, they tell me, oh, please get me a man in Canada. Wow. Mm. Beautiful okay. ladies. All right, so we will be in touch. Yeah. Um, I, I'm so glad. Yeah, so I, I'll, I'll definitely get you a man. I'll not get you a man. No. <laughs> I'll get you a woman. Wow. Yes. What age do you prefer? Are you gonna move to South Africa or do you want the woman to move and come and live here? That's a good question. Mm -hmm. But um, I, I, I'm not sure if. Um, because if she will come back, if she came here, mm -hmm. uh, so she would she need to be sure that uh, someone waiting for her here. Yes. So this is like um, kind of lottery or I don't know. Uh, but then in life you have to take chances. <laughs> if you don't, uh, if one of you doesn't move, then you'll never know if it was ever going to work. So it's either you go and move to South Africa and yes. see if it will work. If it doesn't yes. work, I think you come back here. I think it's better like that. Yeah, because if you say, okay, we, we're going to date and you just do WhatsApp and you just do phone calls, you never know. Mm -hmm. It's important that one of you moves so that you know if it works, if you can live with each other, if you enjoy each other. Obviously, first, you're going to start on the phone, like send text messages, send each other you pictures, mm -hmm. video calls, and see if you like each other. But then you need to have that physical contact. You need to see them in person. Mm -hmm. So one of you will have to move to another country because you can't just be dating and be in different countries like for That's a long period of time. Maybe you can start by she comes visit for two weeks mm. and then you go to South Africa, you visit for two weeks and then you see how it goes. Yeah, I think mm. it's better because I see someone in front uh, of me. Because mm. it's different, you know, when you see someone in front of you, it's different. And you yeah. date someone, you want to see, you want to know how they smell, how they walk, you want to know all the real things, mm -hmm. how they eat, how they chew. How she dance kizomba? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because for True. me it's very important if she like if she uh, dance well or not. Oh, you want someone who can dance well? And you can I, I can teach her. It's not a problem. Oh, perfect. 
It's perfect, perfect, perfect. Wow. But the only problem though is if you come to South Africa, you might never want to come back here. I will what? You will love it so much in South Africa, oh. you won't want to come back here. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This way. Uh. Hmm. There is no snow there. We have all the beautiful animals. We have all, we have everything that's beautiful. Yeah. So if I will never come back to Canada, South Africa. That yes, because uh, you know uh, we uh, receive what we got, what we done. What yes. We, it's you get exchange. what you give. It's an exchange. Yes. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's very very nice here. Even the weather, you don't even feel that it's so cold because people are not cold. You go to other countries, it's not as cold, but the people are just so cold. You can't even say hello to your neighbor. You can't even say hello mm -hmm. to people on the streets. Yeah, where, what, what, which one? Comes? Like England. They are England. Mm. Mm. Uh, yeah, because mentality of the people are different. Yes. They are focuses just for working and not for sharing. Uh... Exactly. Yeah. But yeah, it's even nicer in the summer. Nice, yes, uh, but it's very short. Yeah, the summer is short. If I just uh, want my brother, but uh, all my family rest uh, in Europe. Oh, where in Europe? Poland. Oh, Poland! Yes. I, I, I met a Polish uh, friend in um, in England. Yeah. There's a lot of that. We have a lot of Polish people who live in England. I know a lot of people. She film everything. Yeah, she 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 she's filming. You're gonna see yourself on CBC tonight in the news. <laughs> No, we're just filming for our own like vlog to show people at home what we did in Canada. Ah. Who we saw. And you know that a lot of people in South Africa have never seen snow. Oh, okay. Mm. So it's something different. It's something big for them, something nice. And mm. so we're going to take the video and show them what is snow like. But we won't show them this dirty one. I see. <laughs> in Poland, it can get cold. Yeah, not like here, but kind of. Mm. So it's now four seasons. Yeah. How long have you lived here in Canada? Oh, a lot of years. Mm. Uh, when I was a teenager, I mm. Oh, no. Because your English is. Because in Poland you don't speak English, do you? But no. your English is very good. Thank you. Mm. I speak here with the people. And you speak French as well? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's too much. Too much. <laughs> Polish. All those languages are just difficult. Especially yeah. the, the French and the Polish, it's, just, it's yeah. too difficult. But if you uh, stay here and you study, after you learn uh, the language. You learn the languages. So you came here as a student? Yeah. Mm, nice. Yeah. It's a very nice country, Canada. Yeah. A lot better than America. It's very friendly to foreigners. That's nice to hear this. Mm. I've really enjoyed my stay here. I, I, yeah. I like, people are very friendly. That's one thing I really noticed. Do you, are you a dance instructor? Uh, no, no, I'm not. But I take classes. Oh, nice. Oh, that's very nice. Yeah. I have two left feet. I can't dance. You have, uh, uh, you have to teach me. Yeah, yeah, it's very easy. You will see. Yeah. That would be so nice. And we are leaving tomorrow. It would have been so nice to go and do a little mm. dance class. Oh. Exactly. But we'll take your number. We're coming back in summer and then uh -huh. you can take us dancing. Sure. Mm. Yeah. That would be so nice. That would be so nice. Uh -huh. Where are you dancing? Montreal or here in Brussels? In Montreal. Okay. Yeah. We'll give you a number. 